What's the crack lads? Welcome back to the channel. Just a short and sweet what's coming Monday preview here. And we're into kind of prediction territory here because I think Konami have switched up the schedule and the release schedule here with the legends and with the show times, with the big times, with the featured. Obviously the epics, it's always been based around this on the Monday. So we can kind of know that that's going to come. But they have kind of switched it up a bit with double releases, you know, no releases. It's been a bit weird, man. I definitely think that they're kind of like planning on stuff for eFootball 2025, especially when there's still players that are in the DB that have not been released yet, such as these Guardians here, which would tie in, you would expect, perfectly, especially as a Spain pack hasn't come. You also have these European club Guardians. I honestly thought they were going to stop putting out the club packs, but we all know that they did release the Mbappe with PSG, which brings us on to Monday selection. So this is going to be Monday selection for all we know. It's going to be an English league selection here, as you see here. So it's got from goalkeeper down to attacking midfielders, centre midfielders, centre backs. You've got a lot of different players in here. Not going to spend too much on these because it's all going to be about the Showtime English league players, right? So I'm not too sure who sent on that previous picture. This one is from CTE Football. Van Dijk, Saka and Foden are going to have Showtimes. Two of these players will probably have Showtime skills. People are saying it could be Foden and Van Dijk. Van Dijk maybe have Fortress and maybe Foden will have Game Change and Pass or he'll have Blitz Curler. I don't think he'll have Blitz Curler personally speaking. If he does, he's going to be absolutely broken because Blitz Curler has gotten better uh, in the last couple of weeks again. But also, they still have a lot of these new legends, which... I don't know why they would have added these legends if they weren't going to release them for, you know, during Europe. And like, the thing is, man, right, if Netherlands go out of the game here, right, and shout out to Sapo Pez for these on Twitter and whoever sent me these, like Rijkaard van Basten and Hullet, this would be an unbelievable pack if you're into, you know, spinning for players and stuff. If spinning for players and opening packs doesn't interest you, that's grand, but there's a lot of teams and a lot of players that do like to be upgraded. And a lot of people that like to spin for packs, right? Um, Gerard, this could return to older packs as well. Some packs that you might have missed out on. But yeah, it's just strange because you would imagine that if they were going to be bringing out like teamed packs rather than returning to old school packs like this, like Game Change and Pass, which has been rumored to come back again, Tony Cruz for his final card to come out as a, as a big one and Bellingham obviously as well, which is in the England kit here. It is strange. The release schedule is strange. Obviously, we do know that they still have not released any new squads here. I definitely thought we'd see Spain. I definitely thought we'd see Germany. I mean, you talk about the licenses and stuff like that. I mean, that's not a real big issue because they already have the kits in. They have Portugal, Turkey. They even have Brazil. You know, they have Brazil and Argentina here. Brazil, they don't even have the manager license for this. So it is an interesting one. Genuinely, it is an interesting one. I don't really know if they're going to bring out more. You would expect that they would. But even with the selection that we're getting this week, I mean, is there, it's strange, right? Because is there any hype for, you know, when the English Premier League is over now and everyone is just looking at the Copa America or the Euros? Like, I, I just don't get it, man. I don't get it. Let me know what you guys think. As I said, we can only cover what we can cover, boys. That's all we can do, man. And the content of what's coming, you guys like to have a prediction on it. Drop your predictions in the comments below. I'll read out the best ones for the next video. And of course, have a good day and we'll, we'll talk to you soon.